So today guys, we're going to be talking about why men is to blame for the problems we have in society today and not women. Now yes guys, women is part of the problem with, you know, feminism and all these stuff, but guys, men men has allowed this all this stuff to happen. Look at the late 1800s, you know, the early to mid 1900s with you know them with men allowing women to vote making making them go into the workforce uh you know hence why now there's there has to be two incomes in the home to support a family and also a couple all this is a plot and a plan from the elites above guys and the elites is not only women guys they're also men and men has inf infiltrated the government and also the control of the you know western civilization society and they basically want me and you to be eating the dirt and also in the ground all they care about is themselves guys and also their own families hence why you know they, they tell you it's wrong to eat meat it's wrong for you to drive your gas powered car they want you to basically own an electric car they want you to <clears throat> excuse me they want you to eat the bugs eat vegan only food they don't want you to drive you know gas powered cars they want you to get electric but guys they're the ones who's flying in private jets they're the ones who's flying in gas powered cars they're the ones who's, who's eating all the meat so guys it's just it's just a plot and a plan to destroy society so to go back to the topic of the video of why it's men's fault so yeah so basically men has allowed you know feminism all this to infiltrate the society that's because they want to push their agenda to keep me and you in control and enslaved but they want to keep themselves in power and control and make as mu much money as possible off of us and also the society in play that's why they're removing god from society like 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 guys look at school like when i was going in school god wasn't something that they pushed but they're pushing all this you know woke agenda and everything i'm not going to i'm not going to go too indefinite because 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 youtube's part of the matrix so this is future shin guys after looking back at the video i just want to mention something that also men guys they pay for the only fan subscri subscriptions they pay for the premium for you know corn hub they pay they basically view all the content with women they enable this behavior guys who's watching and consuming all the content from women like in terms of you know the dirty content you know the soft core core that happens on uh, social media and all that men not only women guys it's mostly men if not all men and that is guys like the only fans models or influencers on instagram or social media they wouldn't they wouldn't have a career or like source of income if it wasn't for you guys paying for their subscriptions you know consuming their content basically just paying for their bills guys like it's all of the men's fault that of why they have the careers that they do and that now uh girls who are being raised looking at all this content is now going to become them because you guys know you are the sum of the five people who you spend time with and that goes with also the the content you consume as well the same exact uh fact fact applies so that is one of the other reasons why men is at fault for the problems we have in today's society uh, a quarter or half of all these problems literally within months or years but they don't care they're literally owned by the by the government by the by the people in power by open society by the uh, the world economic forum bro I'm, I'm getting fired up right now but i don't i want to go too in depth in this guys before you know i get shadow banned or taken down or you know killed or whatever obviously i know that's not gonna happen but you guys exactly know what i mean with what happened with tate this last two years or so and other people you know alex jones or whatever but guys men is the leader and and the only re and the only reason why we're in today's problem is because of men because they lost control of the leadership and now they gave it over to the women and now men doesn't care even even though men have to have the power to get it back they don't care they want they want to everyone to be you know equal even though that's you know that's not true like like i said earlier it goes by men or sorry god men woman child it doesn't go it doesn't go woman above all it doesn't work like that and you guys may be, may be thinking this is sexist or whatever but guys life is sexist i have bigger shoulders and naturally than a girl i have you know a pee pee and they have a uh you know <laughs> they have the opposite they don't have the same thing but guys this is not what society is trying to tell you they want you to tell they want to say the opposite they want to say everyone's equal girls could have a career work they don't need a man they don't need kids they don't need a family they don't need marriage all they, all they need is money and all their cats and dogs that's all they need the reason why we're here today with the problems is because of men because men has allowed us to happen and they have the power to get back control but they don't care because they're benefiting from it hence why elon musk is the only one of the only guys and men in leadership who's actually helping uh, cure the problem and prevent it but mark zuckerberg google uh what else i don't know amazon 
They're all part of the matrix and the problem, and they're all mostly run by men. Maybe they're run by women now because they allow it to happen. It's not the women's fault, it's they're the men's fault because men has always been in power and will always be in power. Of course, now it's mostly it's gonna be more women, but it's not gonna it's not gonna be that way forever, guys. Guys, th there's there's always a pendulum, which is basically like a I don't know exactly what it is, but I know like the the point of it. Like it's kind of like a tear tot. Like if one way goes like this, the other way is down. It's gonna keep on going back and forth until like we're back in balance of where we were hundreds or thousands of years ago. But now we're kind of paying the price with what men has did in the 1900s or whatever. We're, we're gonna go back into being a balanced society, not only, you know, where it's down. We're gonna be back to being a balance. So guys, that's pretty much it for the video. I apologize if I went off just random tangents and also like went in circles and kind of got you guys a bit confused. The point of the video is basically saying why men is mostly a problem and not women or why men is to blame because guys if you guys watch all these red pill content creators or even you know whatever just men in general they, they like to only blame women basically the point of the video is explaining why men is to blame for today's society problems and not women obviously women is part of the problem but it's mostly the men's fault because they allowed all these stuff to happen and they keep on allowing it to happen hence why men is to blame so if y'all did find this video helpful and also did enjoy it be sure to like and also subscribe i post videos just like this every week and also sub improvement content as well but yeah thank you so much for watching the video guys have a blessed one take care and peace